Welcome to the Hanlon House Bed and Breakfast, your home away from home. It's so good to have you here. While you're signing the guest book, I'll start telling you a little bit about the history of the house. The house was built in the early 20s in the craftsman style. Dr. Cooper purchased it then and then built the second floor in 1924. And my parents purchased the house in 1957, Jerry and Thelma Hanlon. And in 1967, they started renting the house. However, before they started renting the house, they very seriously had considered making this a bed and breakfast themselves. However, they decided to rent it instead. I uh, was reminded in 2004 when I moved in here about the bed and breakfast, so I jumped on the idea. The first idea that I had was to make this room a gift shop. So in this display case, I have a drum that was made by the great grandniece of Chief Red Cloud. Under this glass dome is a real prize. This is a prototype of Remington's larger sculpture called the Rattlesnake. There are only two of these in the entire world. My second concept for the Hanlon House Bed and Breakfast was to build an art, or use this space as an art gallery and a performance salon. All of these paintings are originals, prints, and Z Clays, regional and Wyoming and Utah artists. All of these paintings are available for purchase here at the Hanlon House Bed and Breakfast. I always like to keep a display of our ink of this out so I can remind people about our English teas. Now over here on this wall we have of family portraits, my mother and father's wedding from 1937, my parents' high school graduation photographs, their parents' weddings, and their dad's dad. So this is my great-grandpa Hans from Germany and my great-grandpa Edward from Ireland. Pretty good combination, wouldn't you think? Makes us a little bit on the stubborn side, I think. but. <laughs> And this is the breakfast part of the Hanlon House Bed and Breakfast. We have breakfast and we cater our breakfast to the time that the individual wants it. If they want breakfast at four o'clock in the morning, I'd be happy to do that. We could do the breakfast here or we can do it privately in their rooms. One of the joys about staying here is that if you stay for a week or if you stay for a month, you get a different breakfast from a different country every morning. Down the hall here, we have a couple of prints of Charlie Russell's, those of you who are familiar with him. And this is my living quarters here in this hallway. At the top of the stairs is the bath. This could either be a shared bath for friends and acquaintances and family, or for those of you who really like to have a private bath, we can arrange that too. You could have the whole floor to yourselves. And then I named all of the bedrooms of the Hanlon House Bed and Breakfast after an Impressionist artist because that's my favorite period of art. And you'll never guess what room this is. That's right, the Van Gogh room. <laughs> Across the hall, we have the Monet room. Monet just loved blue, and I think there's probably blue in every single one of his paintings. And this room is the Mary Cassatt room. Mary Cassatt was one of the few female artists that gained a huge reputation and a lot of respect during that time. And then everybody's, everybody's favorite, favorite room in the house is this room. So I made, I wanted everybody to enjoy the coziness and the ambiance of this room. So I made it into a sitting room. I call it the John Singer Sargent room. This is the only TV in the house. And then I stocked all the drawers in this little chest with books, coffee table books, even some paperbacks to read. And of course the window can see is very conducive to that. Okay, so now you get to choose which room you want to stay in, and then we'll go downstairs. 
As you can see, this space is very conducive to lots of different events and occasions. It's been already used for a small intimate wedding, showers, baby showers. It could also be a place where book clubs could meet, Red Hatters could meet. We have Reader's Theater here. You could even showcase your own personal talent here if you'd like. And we do have lots of different types of packages that would cater for a girl's girlfriend getaway or hunter's packages. That Those you can find on www.hanlinhouse.com. I'm so glad you were able to be here and thank you very much. Looking forward to having you come again.